Hello all, I hope everyone's having a good week so far and staying safe. As we continue our devotional series on our core values of core character, community, craft and culture, I'll be talking about community. Our reference Bible verse that goes with community is from Acts 2, 44 to 46. I'll be reading the NASB version. And all those who had believed were together and had all things in common. And they began selling their property and possessions and were sharing them with all, as anyone might have need. Day by day, continuing with one mind in the temple and breaking bread from house to house, they were taking their meals together with gladness and sincerity of heart. So as we read these uh, these verses, um, and we start off from 44, um, as a team, we are doing things all together. We are all praise and worshipping together in each of our different areas of singers, band, uh, AV. Uh, we all have that oneness together that we are doing something together to bring others to Christ. So as we do this together, um, it brings us all into unity of having the one goal of getting God's word out there. And secondly, worshipping all together. Um, as the as we get to the next uh, verse, as they began selling their properties and possessions and were sharing them with all, uh, this one kind of uh, is a little deeper. There's all kinds of sermons and things online of how deep you can go with this. Would you really sell everything? Um, but the the bottom line of it is, would we really make those sacrifices for each other? Um, and there's been times where family members and and people that we're really close with have ty have things that they need and have circumstances come up and you know you're willing to help but would we really be help willing to help our fellow brothers and sisters in Christ i mean that should be one of the closest relationships we have in our circles of um that oneness that of we have with each other in our group and in our team and in our community so as I read that verse, we should really strive to be able to do all that we can. I know me personally, I try and share all of my things. Uh, my house I use for all kinds of church activities. Um, I really believe that all things I have is from God and I would gladly give all of my things for the use of his kingdom. Um, and ultimately, if the time came and the need come, I have to be at peace that would I sacrifice things for the church and the community and we have to have that mindset if the need arises that yes we should sacrifice all that that we have for God's kingdom because ultimately our time on earth is is but a blip um, and all the sacrifices and stuff we do make will be seen in in God's eyes and once we come into his glory um, you will see the the works that we have done and the sacrifices we've done with our heart. So um, we should, yeah, it's 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 tricky to to talk about it in terms of just our daily day to day and us, the way our society is, and everyone's just working and striving to do the best they can for their families and in their bubbles. Um, but we really should strive to to come out of of that little bubble and try and do more for expanding God's kingdom. Um, it's really good that we, um, as a team, do things for one another. Um, when people are out or people are sick, there are food drives and things like that of that nature. And uh, it's great that we do things together as a, as a team group, uh, as a worship team. Um, but as we look at expanding into our church and into our communities do we have that same drive so um, that's one thing i'm probably going to be working on more is to, to strive to do better with um, helping people in our community because um, i do see a difference in in people that even i hang around with because uh, we are close with some people in our in our worship team uh, as a family and other people do see that and it strives and draws them towards wanting to know more um, about our church or even our, about our team. So even people within the church can see how we function as a team. Um, and then people in the community see how we function in church. That makes 
makes it trickle down all the way to people seeing from the outside coming into church and then ultimately being in our worship team. So all the actions we do um, can, can glorify God all the way up into bringing people to worship with us. Um, so that's what I got out of it. I hope that everyone else has a good week. So I would ponder upon these these verses as we go into the week and really think about the sacrifices we do make for our community. And um, yeah, that's what I have. I'll uh, pray us out. Our dear loving Heavenly Father, Almighty God, we thank you and praise you for this time. We uh, pray that you will go before us as we go into the rest of the week. Give us that um, peace and give us the drive for excellence as we serve you. And as we practice together uh, for this Sunday, we pray that um, you'll use us in mighty ways for our community, that um, they will see your goodness uh, in all that we do as a team as, as, and as a church. And as we speak out, that ultimately will bring um, people to come to know you. And we pray all of this in your loving name. Amen. Have a good rest of the week, guys. Bye.